Hi friends, today I am giving a lecture on ones complement arithmetic. In this ones complement arithmetic, we have to learn about how to perform the subtraction operation using ones complement. Okay, for example, subtract 14 from 25 using 8 bit ones complement arithmetic. In this one, we have to subtract 14 from 25. So that means 25 minus 14. Here, 14 is called as subtrahend and 25 is called as minute. Okay, that means which number is subtracted? That number is called as subtrahend. From which number subtrahend is subtracted? That number is called as minute. Here 25 is called as minute and 14 is called as subtrahend. Okay. Here this subtraction is performed using one's complement. Okay. So now 25 can be represented in binary form. So that is 25 can be taken as 16 plus 8 plus 1. Okay. So 16 is nothing but 2 power 4 and 2, 8 is nothing but 2 power 3 and 1 is nothing but 2 power 0. So that means, so we are taking 2 power 0, 2 power 1, 2 power 2, 2 power 3 and 2 power 4. So here 2 power 4 is there, 1, 2 power 3 is there, 1 and 2 power 0 is there, 1. So remaining bits are zeros. So this is the binary form of 25. Okay, next 14 can be written as, so 8 plus 4 plus 2. So that means 2 power 3. Here 4 can be written as 2 power 2, 1, 2 can be written as 2 power 1. So according to that 1, 1, here uh, 1, next 2 power 0 term is not there, that is 1, 1, 1, 0. So this is the binary form of 14 and this is the binary form of 25. So this can be represented in 8 bit form. So that, so 25 can be uh, written as, so we have to take 8 bit, so that is 0, 0, 0, next one, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, okay, so this is the 8 bit of, 8 bit binary form of 25, next we have to take 14, so 14 is equal to, so that is 1, 1, 1, 0. Remaining 4 bits are 4 zeros. Okay. So this is the binary form of 25. This is the binary form of 14. Okay. Next. Which number is subtracted? Okay. That number can be represented in the form of 1's complement. Okay. So here... 14 is the subtrahend. Now we have to find out the one's complement of subtrahend 14. First, we have to find out one's complement of One's complement of subtrahend, subtrahend 14 and add it to and add it to minute.
so now one's complement of one's complement of 14 is we have to take the one's complement by inverting 0 to 1 and 1 to 0 here 0 is inverted as 1 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 1 is inverted as 0 1 is inverted as 0 1 is inverted as 0 and 0 is inverted as 1 okay now this is the ones complement of subtrahend 14 is 4 ones triple zero 1 now this can be added to the minute so that is 25 0 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 and 14 ones complement of 14 that is 1 1 1 1 0 0 0 1 okay so this is ones complement of 14 ones complement of 14 okay so now we have to add okay so now 1 plus 1 that is 0 with carry 1 0 plus 0 plus 1 so that is 1 0 plus 0 that is 0 1 plus 0 that is 1 1 plus 1 0 with carry 1 next 1 plus 1 0 with the carry 1 1 plus 1 0 with the carry 1 1 plus 1 uh, 0 with the carry 1 so now this is the end around the carry so this is carry bit carry bit while performing one's complement arithmetic that is one's complement subtraction if any carry is generated as carry out bit this carry output is added to the lsb bit that is plus one okay so after that what is the result we are getting zero plus one that is one so only one next one zero next here zero 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 okay so this is after adding the carry out bit at the lsb side then we are getting the result so now this is the lsb bit and this is the msb bit okay if the msb bit value is zero so then we can say that the result is positive number if msb bit is equal to zero the result is positive the result is positive if the msb bit is equal to 1 the result is negative the result is negative okay so now observing the msb bit here msb bit is equal to 0 so therefore the result is positive the result is positive okay what is the what is the decimal value of 1001 so the decimal value of the decimal value of 00001011 is here 1 into 2 power 0 plus 1 into 2 power 1 here 0 into 2 power 2 plus 1 into 2 power 3 so that is equal to uh, 1 plus 2 plus 0 plus 8 so that is equal to 11 so 11 is the answer 
so 25 minus 11 25 minus 14 so that is 11 is the answer so in this way we have to perform the subtraction operation in one's complement okay here we have to perform the 25 minus 14 here 25 is called as minute and 14 is called as subtrahend so which number is subtracted that number is called as subtrahend from which number we have to subtract the subtrahend is called as minute okay first both numbers can be represented in a binary form next we have to find out the one's complement of subtrahend so this is one's complement of subtrahend once we are getting the one's complement of subtrahend this result is added to the minute if any carry out bit is generated that carry out bit is called as end around carry this end around carry is added at the lsb side okay next after getting the result first we have to observe the msb bit if the msb bit is equal to 0 the result is positive if the msb bit is equal to 1 the result is negative so here in this result the msb bit is equal to 0 so the result is positive okay next one the result is positive so what is the decimal value of this number the decimal value of this binary number is that is 11 okay suppose if the msb bit is equal to 1 the result is negative and the result is also in one's complement form okay to get the magnitude of the result again we have to perform the one's complement then we are getting the normal value okay so in this way we have to perform the one's complement subtraction operation next in this next video we have to solve some example problems okay